Sometimes I have this dream where my mom and I are looking out at the sea. And she's starting to say something, but I can't quite pick up on it. It's like this piece of a memory I can't quite remember fully. Just like all the other memories of her in my mind. I thought she'd come to San Francisco that weekend because she just wanted to visit me. It was the first time we'd seen each other since I moved out. I didn't know it was because she wanted to see me one more time before leaving. This is so beautiful. Wow, you're so beautiful. Wow, you're so beautiful. Wow, you're so beautiful. Wow, you're so beautiful. Isn't this your home? Yes, yes. This is my home. But now you've grown up. I've been in a small place in this small place. In the school, there were some very unusual things. Everything is very fast. I don't know how the result will be. This place is too isolated. I'm feeling very sad. And my father, who is my wife's wife, is very young. His body is not good. I want to go back to my family. 回中国住一段时间吧。唉，也许我是自私啊。No, you're not. You're not selfish. I just, I think you've had an impact on a lot of people here. You've had some bad students, but you've had a lot of ones that you enjoy teaching as well, right? Just, isn't that what you wrote in your book? What? You 读我的书了？当然了，我几个月前就读了。That's a Now things have changed. Ultimately, ultimately what matters most is your, your physical and emotional health, right? I just... I don't want to be that far away from you, right? <laughs> Concerns about the deadly coronavirus officially hitting the U.S. Here's what we know. A Washington state resident fell ill after returning from Wuhan, China, where the outbreak began. Officials now say more than 400 people have been sickened and nine people have died. The World Health Organization is holding an emergency meeting right now. Kena Whitworth is in Seattle, has the latest for us. Good morning, Kena. Hey, Robin, good morning. So that patient is a man in his 30s. He is in the hospital here behind me. Now, officials are describing his condition as satisfactory, but he will remain in isolation for at least the next couple of days. They will continue to monitor him as well as the health care providers and patients he came into contact with after testing positive for the coronavirus.